My name is Steve, and this is the original Life and Sad Ending channel. How could it be that two of the most successful TV stars reportedly couldn't stand each other? Both actors had achieved something that few others have ever done in the history of television. They each starred in three successful TV series. Michael Landon, of course, did Bonanza, Little House, and Highway to Heaven. Bill Bixby shot to stardom on My Favorite Martian, then The Courtship of Eddie's Father, and The Incredible Hulk. Bill Bixby and Michael Landon only met once while playing against each other on a short-lived game show called Baffle in April of 1973. Both were very competitive and both wanted to win, but Bixby understood that it was a friendly game. On the other hand, Landon took it extremely seriously to the point that he ignored Bixby's good-natured attitude and completely snubbed him. The two never worked together again. Maybe Landon had competitive feelings against Bixby's popularity on TV. Show business can be tough. Back in those days, there were only three networks and a limited number of shows that were needed. The truth is, people liked both of them a lot. Lucille Ball was really the only other star to have such repeated success. Maybe this incident had been overblown after all. Near the end of his life, Bill Bixby who was battling prostate cancer, said in an interview that he often thought of his late friend and colleague, Michael Landon. It turns out both were diagnosed with cancer the same week at the same hospital. Bill said, quote, The day I was told I had cancer, Michael was in an office next door. When the big C word hits you, it's very difficult to handle. It's terrible to be told. It was hard enough to hear about myself. But when I heard about Michael, I just sat down and cried. Sadly, Michael Landon had died of pancreatic cancer on July 1, 1991 in Malibu, California. He was only 54 years old. Just over two years later, on November 21, 1993 in Los Angeles, California, Bill Bixby died of prostate cancer. He was only 59 years old. Yes, unfortunately, the two did have much in common. I was a big fan of both Landon and Bixby. How about you? Thanks for watching. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe. I'll see you next time, if I don't come to a sad ending.